Hello guys, this is Mahesh from Full Stack Dev. In this particular video, we are going to see how to choose themes, install plugins and then create pages in WordPress website. So you can see here a WordPress dashboard. I am going to click on appearance then theme. You can see here a default theme. I am going to click on add new. I am going to use a theme called combine light yeah this one I'm going to click on that it will show a preview here so I'm going to click on install it's installing and then I'm going to click on activate so the combine light theme is install and activated here so the default theme will look like this on your website after that I'm going to click on plugins So it will show a default plugin here. I am going to check these plugins and deactivate them. And then select these plugins again and going to delete. So we are going to start fresh. Yep. Let's so click on add new then I'm going to search Elementor yeah Elementor page builder install now then I'm going to click on activate You can see a, a page here after installation so I'm going to install another plugin here so go to plugins and then add new and then search for child theme click on install child themeify then click on activate we need child themeify to create a child theme of our existing theme to create a new pages you need to go to pages delete the sample page first and click on add new so first page is home click on publish I'm going to add another one called about click on publish add new services and last one is contact us click on publish so I have created four pages here you can see it here all pages click on the all pages and now you can see these pages so go to appearance then menus create a menu name it I'm going to name this menu is main menu click on the create menu so now you can see left side here there is a list of pages I'm going to check 
it and then add to menu you can arrange a menu from here so I'm going to arrange it like home services about and contact is if you want to then you can check it as a primary menu okay uh, I'm also going to check automatically add new top level pages to this menu click on this same menu now uh, visit your website and see you can see a menu here home services about and contact us right but by default it's not showing home page showing recent posts so if you want to uh, show by default your home page then go to your dashboard then settings and click on reading check this option static page and select home page and click on save changes now go to your site and see the default page is now home page yeah there is uh, you can click to edit from here or you can go to dashboard then all pages and from here you can edit your page as well So you can see here a home page and at the right side of this page you can see recent post recent comments so in case if you want a full width page then we need to go to the dashboard then select template select template as a full width out of element of full width then click on update click on edit with elementor now you can see a full width page here so I'm going to click on this folder icon to add a template there is a predefined template provided by Elementor some of them are free I'm going to click one of them so it will look like this it will show you a preview all right so I'm going to click on insert button yeah so the page is inserted you can drag and drop the contents from the left menu as well and you can edit these existing contents so I'm going to click on update for now and check my website so it will show my default home page with the inserted template look at this we have created our first page home page yep so you can edit click on customize then go to site identity and remove this tagline and here so you can type here your company name Click on publish you can upload a site icon from here like this so I'm not going to do that I'm going to close this yeah 
now your site will look like this so we are going to create services about and contact us page so go to your dashboard all pages now I'm going to edit services before click on edit with Elementor we need to set a full width page click on update then edit with Elementor yeah you see you can see here so you can add a layout from here you can see a columns right so I'm going to click on that two columns and you can add elementor elements from here like this drag and drop right if you do not want these columns you can delete like this so I'm going to delete those elements this column too okay so I'm going to simply click on the template folder to add template I'm going to search services I'm going to choose this one so I'm going to click on insert yep as I said before you can change the content very easy I am going to leave it as it is click on update so let's create a about page now I'm going to speed this video in case the same procedure we are going to do click on all pages then edit out page choose elementor full width then click on update then edit with elementor click on add template so if you want to edit then just right click on the element and go to edit selection now you can see here you can change images or a color like this right so uh, I'm going to change the gradient color here all right this one too right click edit selection go to overlay background overlay and change it from here yeah that's it click on update and now we are going to edit contact us full width Elementor full width update then edit with Elementor I'm also going to add a template here I'm going to search contact yeah this one is good it looks good so I'm going to click on insert Yep. 
yeah you can change color here you can make changes like right click on that and edit icon or edit selection you can edit styles from here like this So you can make changes like this so I'm going to click on update and now you can see your website your home page then services your about page and a contact us page okay that's it guys that's how you can choose theme install plugins and create your wordpress pages Thank you very much for watching this video. On the next video, we will see how to configure a contact form on a WordPress and make it working. Subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon.